All right, y'all, welcome back to Combat Arms Channel. Okay, so we're gonna be playing Call of Duty 4 Remastered. Now, I'm very excited about this, and I don't know if you guys have heard in the previous videos, but I did play Call of Duty 4 back when it was released in 2007, and I was a huge fan of it, so much so that it really uh, impacted my decision for actually joining the Marine Corps and joining the military in general. Now, I know I definitely wanted to join the military, but joining the Marine Corps was just one of those things where it just felt natural, and Call of Duty 4 just really helped cement that. So, yeah, I have a lot of fond memories with Call of Duty 4, so I'm very excited to get into it and replay it and sort of relive those memories. Now, I know a lot of y'all wanted me to react to the Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War trailer. Now, I'm not really too spun up on Call of Duty Black Ops. I know it took place in like the 70s, I think. It was like a Vietnam sort of game. So I don't know if all the Black Ops actually followed in that path as far as like the whole timeline and everything. But uh, I guess the Cold War would come after that, so it makes a lot of sense. So I figured I would just throw in the reaction as well because I wanted to check it out anyway. And it would also hype me up for playing Call of Duty 4 Remastered. So let's just uh, check this out and see see what it looks like. All right, so 1440p at 60 frames a second. Should look pretty good, so let's check this out again. Black Ops Cold War, I don't really know what to expect, especially since Cold War wasn't an actual war. So, I don't know, it might be like some, some secret squirrel stuff that happened in the background or whatever they're trying to say. But yeah, let's get into it. Should be cool. Yeah, there's a real weird styling to Black Ops, I've noticed. Okay. This war was a lie. Years of blood. Just to light the fuse of a secret war. Decades in the making. Okay, I gotta say, I love the whole Vietnam aesthetic. With Call of Duty, they do take it a little bit too far to where, like, everything is just like, you know, of course, every helmet has to have the writing on it. So you have to have all the rounds in the and the cat eye helmet band and all this crazy stuff but it is a very cool aesthetic and uh yeah i can i can appreciate those who actually fought in vietnam so this is just again taking it to a whole nother level but it's it's cold war so we'll see where that really takes place if it does at all i guess okay here we go my fellow americans Nuclear conflict would well be mankind's last. We want to make this a more peaceful world. Five days ago, we acquired intel. Soviet agent Perseus is in play. If he's active, something big is gonna happen. Okay, so yeah, kind of like what I was thinking where there's just like stuff happening behind the scenes where, uh, of course it, Call of Duty does a pretty good job of not following normal historical battles and everything. It kind of just makes up its own thing, which is totally fine. It works well, and it's cool how it sort of fits its story into the, the realm of these actual conflicts that took place. So, I mean, this does, does seem pretty cool. It's a cool idea, especially sort of staying out of the limelight and everything. But the Call of Duty characters are just so over the top sometimes. It's funny to see. Something that could shift the balance of the Cold War. Let's go find this shithead. Looks good though. Mr. President, is the threat real? Yes, sir, we believe it is. Give Mr. Adler whatever he wants. That's cool. Definitely looks like Call of Duty. So I know they do that with, um, I think it was one of the earlier Black Ops where they actually had uh, JFK as a president. So yeah, it's cool that they're actually, again, sort of blending the Call of Duty universe into the, the rest of the, the actual historical timeline of what actually happened. So it looks okay. I mean, the graphics are, are good. It's Call of Duty. It's going to look good. It's not anything crazy. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I think I think the the feeling of Black Ops just feels a little bit weird. Uh, I, it just feels so disconnected from from like actual firearms and 
and everything. So I couldn't really get into Black Ops as much as other Call of Duties like Modern Warfare 2 and Call of Duty 4. Call of Duty 4 was a very early Call of Duty, but I don't know, it just felt a little bit better. And Black Ops just has like a certain style to it. I don't know, it's kind of weird, but I mean, it's a, it's a good game. Of course, a lot of people love it. I just wasn't a huge fan of it. That's why I sort of fell off with the, the whole Call of Duty and, and everything. But yeah, it looks pretty solid. I don't know if it's for me. And I don't know if it's a, uh, so it's called the Cold War. So I guess that would be like a new campaign. I, I don't really know how the DLC works with a lot of this stuff, but I imagine it's like a whole new campaign, which is kind of cool, but I don't know how long it's actually going to be. Yeah, it looks pretty, looks pretty cool. Again, it's not really for me. I'm not really a huge fan of Black Ops. It's cool to check out at least. It's cool to stay up to date on Call of Duty, but yeah, I don't know how I feel about it. But Call of Duty 4, I do know how I feel about that. And remastered should be pretty fun. Again, I think I'm just more used to the whole modern timeline and of everything, just because that's what I've lived through, like the whole global war and terror aspect. But yeah, okay, let's uh, let's get into Call of Duty 4 remastered then. All right. Yeah, the uh, I guess I don't even know what you'd call it. Like the interface, this whole menu setup looks completely different. So kind of like it. Yeah, I mean, okay, let's do it. Oh, that's loud. That is very Good loud. Good news first, the world's in great shape. We've got a civil war in Russia, government loyalists against ultranationalist rebels, okay. and 15,000 nukes at stake. Just another day at the office. <laughs> Khaled al Assad, currently the second most powerful man in the Middle East. Now, word on the street is he's got the minerals to be top dog down there. Intel's keeping an eye on him. And the bad news? We've got a new guy joining us today. <laughs> selection. His name's Soap. That is bad news. It can be a struggle when you get a new guy. This initial part is really cool, though. Not a lot of games did like this. Uh, I don't know. It's like kind of like a cool tutorial mode. Good to see you, mate. Take one of the rifles from the table. Guys. I kind of thought he would look more like uh, he does in the new Modern Warfare. Spoiler alert, I guess. You know the drill. Go to station one and aim your rifle down range. Oh yeah, this definitely feels like Call of Duty 4. Lovely. Let's see if now I can still. Shoot at the targets while firing from the hip. Okay. I love the G36 though. It's so now cool. Aim your rifle down range. Now shoot each target while aiming down the sights. I think someone who is like in the SAS would be pretty good with this, but okay. Now I'm going to block the targets with a sheet of plywood. Bullets will penetrate thin, weak materials like wood, plaster, and sheet metal. I want you to shoot the targets through the wood. Yeah, I remember when Call of Duty 4 like introduced this, like the whole shooting through stuff. I feel like it was like the first now game I did that. Pop up one at a time. Hit all of them as fast as you can. Yeah, let's see. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I don't have a sidearm. I can't switch to the sidearm. Drop a good job, mate. Now go get a sidearm from the armory. Oh, the watermelon. Was I supposed to do that? I'm supposed to wait, I guess, huh? Good. Now switch to your rifle. Now pull out your sidearm. Remember, switching to your pistol is always faster than reloading. Those are some very bright nice. night sights. Your fruit killing skills are remarkable. <laughs> Captain Price wants to see you. All right. Wow, that's quick. Yeah, I like the whole, like, okay, let's see what they got. They got every weapon under the sun. They even got the badass M16-203. That's sick. <laughs> okay, let's go see Captain Price. Yeah, this is a whole Call of Duty right here. Just tanks driving around, helicopters flying around. I don't know what these guys are doing. That dude's pretty big. What's going on here? <laughs> I'm sure he'll be thrilled to see you. Yeah, everyone's just like a private. <laughs> Freaking Call of Duty, man. I mean, this would be a badass environment to train around, though. Here we go. 
The dude constantly wearing a balaclava and goggles. Go eat young and sir. It's his first day in the regiment. <laughs> right. What the hell kind of name is Soap, eh? How'd a muppet like you pass selection? <laughs> Soap, it's your turn for the CQB test. Everyone else head to observation. For this test, you'll have to run the cargo ship solo in less than 60 seconds. Gaz holds the current squadron record at 19 seconds. Good luck. Climb the ladder That's there. pretty quick. Even for, like, real life, if you're actually throwing flashbangs and everything, there's no way. Unless you're just straight up running through that thing. Pick up that MP5 and four flashbangs. On my go, I want you to rope down Dude. to the deck and rush to position one. After that, you will storm down the stairs to position two. Then hit position three and four, following my precise instructions at each position. Okay. Grab the rope when you're ready. All right, you ready to watch this, Sergeant Love... Oh, I know. I saw in Lovejoy. You ready to watch this? I like how they're wearing their gas masks. There's no way they'd be wearing all that. That thing would be fogged go, go, up. Go. Hit the targets. Two, go. Gotta reload. Uh. Hit the targets. Flashbang through the door. Here we go. Hit the Kinda remember this. Hit the targets. Where's the other one? Okay. Go back. What you mean? Bro. All right, well, this is, this is bad. This is very bad. All right, I'm definitely doing that again. That was freaking 33. Yeah, I'm not doing right anyway. Okay, so the, the thing with this is you need to conserve your ammo. All right, all right, all right. All right. Let's do this. I think because the rate of fire is a little slower. Let's try it. Okay. Boom. Flashbang. Boom. 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 Flashbang. Oh, this is this is good. Yes, sir. That was better. Not great. Hey, I'll take it. Now I'm good. The cargo ship mission is a go. Get yourself sorted out. Wheels up at 0200. Dismissed. It's kind of early, don't you think? Jeez, trying to get some rest. Okay, I'll do hard ends. Veteran, you guys don't want to watch me play veteran. I would just get my butt handed to me over and over again because, you know, it's all, it's all realistic and stuff, and that's kind of gross. So we'll stick with hard end. That's pretty much what I've been doing with Call of Duty anyway. Okay, uh, I think my webcam just unplugged because my USB splitter just like overheated or something, but we're good now, so we'll just continue on. Co missed a little bit of the cutscene, but cargo mission, I sort of understand what we're doing, so I guess let's jump right into it. This looks sick, though. It doesn't even need to look so much better because, like, their aesthetic just looks badass. Oh, look at that knee pad, though. <laughs> Radio check. Go to secure channel. Lock and load. Green light. Go, go, right. go. Oh, nice. Soaking wet faster. That'll be fun. Weapons free. Say no more. Ready to secure. Hold your fire. Guys, stay in the boat till we secure the deck. Bad oh, ass. Okay. Let's do it. Stairs clear. I remember this part. <laughs> I never actually like waited to see if he said anything else. These guys sleeping in their full kit. <laughs> All right, let's get it. Man, look at, there's no way. Okay, all right, let me tell you something right here. If you're on a ship and the waves are that big, we would not just be chilling like this. Absolutely not. We would be 
falling side to side. We've been moving like crazy. You would not be able to hit anything. But, okay. I mean, I guess these guys are the SAS. Go two on the platform. I see him. Alright, yep, two. Take the dude on the right. Target neutralized. Take him too. Cool. The suppressor sounds interesting. Sounds better, I guess. It's not as quiet as people would think. Okay, man, we would be soaking wet. Oh! Ah! Uh. See, the MP5 is good, but for this, not as good. Okay, I guess we're waiting for the helo. Where's he at? Uh. <laughs> Is that a fuel already? They could have planned that a bit better, I think. Okay. Uh huh. <laughs> and they do the exact opposite. Check those corners. Clear right. Clear I mean, Hallway, clear. Okay. I'll try and add some tactics into this because these guys clearly aren't. Alright, so check this corner. Cool. I clear guess we're right. just gonna go anyway. Yes, Alright. Movement right. Yep, what we got. Oh, we got a hallway. Oh. Watch that shotty, guys. All right. One tango down. Another on the right. Another on the left. Tango down. Okay. Hallway They're down. Clear. Okay. Got a space. Good. Clear left. Ready clear up. right. Move up. The heck? Stand by. On my go. Ah, oh, that was a dude. <laughs> All right, we're good. Oh, Flash bang out. Go. that's not gonna do very much if they're like shooting from far away. I'm just saying. All right. Oh, okay. I guess we're just going into it. All clear. Got you covered. Move up. This is sketchy. Again, it's a ship, so it's not gonna work out too well. Support but on me. we're kind of just running into it. No oh, where's he at, Move up. dude? Let's do the frickin' okay. Yeah, I'm gonna take that. <laughs> okay. Pushing up. Guys, right side. I'm on it. Oh. Yeah, I hope you got all that, dude. It's a lot. It's cover. Stack up. Okay. Where are we stacking? Alright, let's do it. Okay, you would not be kicking that open as well. Move. Those things are not easy to push. And you think you're just going to kick it like that? Alright. Right. Maybe if you're like a sprinter and your legs are huge. Oh! Alright, we got a couple on the catwalks. Move up. Good grief! Can't hit anything because we keep moving. Alright, he's down. Alright. More on the floor, throwing a flashbang. Alright, oh, he felt that. Alright. Clear right. Clear left. Stack up. Stand by. On my go. <laughs> All the, the military verbiage stack Already. up and they're not Get even ready. stacking up. Okay, whatever. Throwing a flashbang. On my mark. Go. Oh, okay, there we go. We have the same idea. Ooh. All right, watch out. We got one coming up. We got two Russian. Okay. We got some on the catwalk on the left. This dude. All right. Oh, I do have freaking frags. You want to be pretty careful with frags on a ship, but... Oh, oh, ah! Watch out. Grenade. All right, we're pushing up. What's up, homie? Stop shooting at him. 
Okay. He's down. He's Tango down. down. Report. All clear. Roger that. Alright, right side's clear. I'm getting a strong reading, sir. Okay. That's pretty good. This is hardened? Come on now. Oh, my bad. What we got? It's an Arab. Place to eat. This is Bravo 6. We've found it. Ready to secure package patrol. Oh, is this like a nuke? No time, Bravo 6. Two bogeys headed your way fast. Grab what you can and get the hell out of there. Probably shouldn't shoot nukes, but. We better go. So, grab the manifest in the container. Move. All right, everyone okay. topside. Double time. Yeah, bounce. Oh man, they'd be getting so seasick. What's your status? Already in the helicopter, sir. Enemy aircraft inbound. Shit. The heck did they hit us with? Come in. Bravo 6, what's your status? Shit. What the hell happened? The ship's sinking. We've got to go now. Come in, damn it. He's like up to his waist already. Yeah, it's a, it's a good idea. Let's do it. Yeah, they, they hit us with, with something hard. What's happening now, though? The ship's just falling apart? I don't think ships are designed to just break apart like this. But that's scary stuff right there. Where the hell are you? Stand by! We're almost there! Which way? Which way to the helicopter? To the right! To the right! Okay. We're running out of time! Come on, let's go! <laughs> Look at those swells, dude! Oh! I'm getting stuck. I'm getting stuck. I'm not gonna make it. Bro, you could have gotten a little bit closer. We're all aboard! Go! Roger that. We're out of here. Base plate, this is Big Bird. What's happening? What's exploding? <laughs> okay, to be honest, with swells like that, we would have been having way more trouble early on anyway. Oh man, the the Call of Duty universe is amazing. You get hit by like one thing and all of a sudden the entire steel ship just starts exploding from all over. Okay. The Red Sea. Hmm. Okay. This is like satellite imagery, but it's like a drone. So I don't know how that works. Oh yeah, I forgot about this cutscene. <laughs> Should have found a better safe house, I guess. To think like this is nothing compared to what we saw in the, the new Modern Warfare. Where you're like a kid and whatnot. Hey dude, gotta gotta chill out there. <laughs> I love Call of Duty where like People just have these random ass weapons. They're just transporting me in some like random vehicle. I mean, I guess they don't really have too much opposition right now. It's a big sunroof though. It's like a Tesla.
Oh man. You can make it, dude. Oh. Okay, well, yeah. Oh. What's got I wish we like were able to find out exactly what was going on here because Sheesh. It's never been this crazy in the Middle East as far as I'm aware. But then again, I don't know how how big this is. Might just be like one town or something. But I mean they're capturing the president, so this must be something crazy. Oh, he's about to be having a bad day. <laughs> oh. What is this? They got freaking, like, military dogs now? Random ass German Shepherd in the Middle East. Oh yeah, the uh, the enemies are like two or three models. They all look very similar. Guess that's one of the limitations with these earlier engines and and whatnot. It looks like he's 16. <sighs> yep, we all know what happens next. Unless you don't. But uh, I guess that was a bit of a spoiler. We'll find out. There he is. I forgot the names of everyone in Call of Duty 4 though. At least the bad guys. They're not very iconic. You don't really know anything about this dude. I think there's another Call of Duty where you learn a bit more, but... Bro, your, your beret looks like shit, homie. This is how it begins with a fucked up beret and some ugly shades on. Schmuck. Well, that's one way to go. 50 cal Desert Eagle. That wouldn't feel too good. Captain Price. Al-Assad just executed President Al-Falani on national television. <laughs> the Americans have plans for Al-Assad, and it's too late to do anything for Al-Falani. But in less than three hours, code name Nikolai will be executed. Nikolai, sir. Nikolai is our informant in the ultra-nationalist camp. He supplied the intel on the cargo ship operation. Oh, he looks different. Yeah, I'm still not too Nikolai's familiar with the right story. Now. We're gonna walk him out. We take care of our friends. Let's move. Okay. The loyalists are expecting us half a click to the north. Move out. Loyalists, huh? Are the good Russians on the he's have night vision with a boonie oh, hat. Oh, he's probably got the. Uh... Yeah, well, that's good enough. Skull crusher is what we'd call it. It's like a strap that you put on for the night vision. Not very comfortable though. And it doesn't stay in place very well. Weapons free. Oh dude, this is sick. Oh the claymores. This weird This Enemy weird control. red dot sight that you would never use because it would just shatter the glass almost immediately. How do I turn my night vision? Oh there we go. Okay. All the lasers. Should be a few more guard posts up ahead. 
Okay. Uh, just random TV out here. Okay. Yeah, Call of Duty was simpler because you're not really driving any vehicles so much. Oh, this would be very bright for night vision. With that much illumination, this would look super bright. What? That's so excessive, but whatever. I wish claymores were that easy to set up too. I really do. Alright, well, what do I do? Shoot? One down. <laughs> I love it. Oh. Enemy down. Okay, what do we got? Oh, we got one dude going off the back. Oh, boy. Is he down? Alright, dude. See ya. You guys need to cover my sides. Start calling out some targets. Okay, that's, mm, that's good. Yeah, I probably wouldn't have night vision on for this unless I was really trying to use my laser to my advantage, but it's not gonna help so much. Guys, you smell that? Where you at? <laughs> Welcome to the new Russia. <laughs> What's the target camera? We've got an informant to recover. The M twenty one's on the other side of the hill. Yeah, he's the got him on. Killed hundreds of civilians in the valley below. Not so fast. He's still looking. There's night vision. You're with us. <laughs> I guess I owe you one. Bloody right, you do. They're all just like, why are you still using your night vision, dude? Like, the sun is like up, basically. Alright. I wonder who these, these are just some random, like, Russian dudes. I mean, okay. See what kind of mess we can get into with these guys. Ooh. Oh, he's got some old night vision. Yuck. All right, where are we going, dudes? Nope, over here. I need like a direction or something, homie. We can't just stay over here. You should know that. <laughs> okay. Nope, yeah, yeah. Position. Guys, cover the left flank. Roger, covering left flank. Oh, what we got. It's okay. Take the dude in the back. Oh yeah, I forgot. You can like pretty much shoot totally straight. Don't take out the machine gunners in the window, so camera off snake and stop the building. Okay. They're down. Oh, this this sounds a lot better though, from what it originally sounded like. All right, he's down. They're making entry. <laughs> oh, take a fire. All right, we got some dudes. Make it quick, Camaro. I want that informant. We have nothing to worry about. We'll take out the M21s and carve a path straight. Oh man, this is hard to hit. All right, dude. Are we good? Are we good? What's going on? <laughs> what the heck? Just random rockets and everything. All right, we're doing it. He's still got his night vision on, dude. What the heck? Oh, 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 oh. Contact on the right. Alright, what do we got? Paint a, paint, paint a picture. Yep, okay. Got 10 dudes. 
roughly. Oh, we got RPG team. And good night. Ooh. Okay. Easy day. And we got John Rambo over here. Oh, RPGs. This is working out pretty well. I'm gonna push up. Oh yeah, I forgot we do have the the old old fashioned noob tube. The good old days. Let's do it. Oh. Alright, we got some more on the hill. There we go. Let's do one of these. We got, we got another. Beautiful. And then one for him. Man, I love the grenade launcher so much. That's it. All day. All day. Okay, this night vision kind of sucks. It's not very realistic. Okay, he's down. Alright, let's push up. Running out of time. Help us! The further my men can get into this village, the closer we will be to securing your informant. <laughs> We're just doing his dirty work now. I wish you could change it to the semi auto though. That'd be sick. Man down. Man down, what you mean? Oh, I thought that was Yeah, these are bad guys, right? Okay. I can't really do too much against a tank, homie. It's hard to get a positive identification and make sure these guys are enemies or not. Alright, well, have fun with that one. There's a lot of dudes down there. Oh yeah, this is, uh, what, like a repel? Let's see how this looks. Look, see if this is accurate. The final assault has already begun. With a little bit more of your sniper support, we are sure to be victorious. Captain Price. I need to ask one more favor. And I'm slimy. Where is the informant? Stop the Zealous! Stop Sumas Shell! Where is the Zealous? The house! <laughs> the house of the northeast end of the village! Well, that wasn't so hard, was it? Never guys, this is messing around. So, guys, we've got to reach that house before anything happens to the informant. Let's go. Alright. Well, wow, I have a 350 rounds. That's a lot of magazines. Alright, let's see. Repel. What are we anchored to? Nothing? Alright. <laughs> He's got no glove on. Yeah, totally, dude. Alright. <laughs> Alright, machine gun in the window. The guys by the crates. Alright, pushing up. Moving to the tractor. Or whatever that is. I'm not a farmer or construction, so... <laughs> All right, let's make some noise real quick. This is the cool thing about Call of Duty. You can just pick up whatever you want and start launching things and then switch back to your old weapon. All right, I think we got, oh boy. That dude is accurate. All right. Bad guy, yep. All right, let's push up. Let's do it. All right, gas on me. Make an entry. He's down. Okay. Oh! Yep. Alright, buying the door off. Alright, make an entry. Alright, we got a doorway and a window on the left. Oh! Ah! Alright, guys. Dude. I called out that window. You knew I was going for the door. Possibly. I mean, yeah, military stuff is expensive. All right, where you at, dude? What's up? Someone cover that doorway. Make an entry. Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Captain Price, my dude. Okay. Well, we got one death so far. Not too bad. 
All right, let's push up. All right, we're moving. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Bloody hell, let's move. We may still be alive. All right, dude. Well, sorry, I'm not trying to get shot up here. We gotta identify where we're going. Watch out, Got the car, he's down. Captain Price is running in, dude. He's wild. Guys, go around to the back and cover power. So, get ready. Yep, get my night vision on, I know what that means. See, this is way easier, Guys, better, than, better than the new Modern Warfare where you have to shoot all the lights out and it's just a pain in the butt. Or find all the power switches. Okay. What do you got? Victor, electricist for Pegaslo. What? These night vision goggles make it too easy. You're not wrong. But you're still being a little bit careless with the tactics, my guy. Okay, I'm going on the right. Oh. He's down. Forgot we gotta do headshots, of course. I hear someone, Price. What we got? Okay. Get this doorway. What we got? What we got? Well, he'll have fun with that anyway. Alright, he's down. Watch out, Price, dude. Get, get behind some cover, homie. All right, good stuff. Okay, we got a doorway on the left, doorway on the right. I'll cover the door on the left. All right, it's clear. All right, we got the informants. I'll cover this room. We're good. All right. Oh, price! <laughs> What's this guy doing, dude? I hate that. The NPCs in this game are just... I don't know. I mean, I, I guess I should have expected that, but... Okay, Price. You want to do this Call of Duty way? Let's do it the Call of Duty way. Wow. I had one round and I got him. <laughs> okay. You can go in first, dude. You freaking never go in first. All right. Okay. It's him. Nikolai, are you all right? Can you walk? Yes, I can still fight. Thank Hell you for yeah. getting me out of here. Big Bird, this is Bravo 6. We have the package. Hey, okay. LZ1, over. Bravo 6, this is Big Bird. We're on our way. Now. Let's go. All right. Extract. Oh, man, they're really quick. They're right on station, huh? They're not messing about. Though there's not really a whole lot of shooting anymore, so I guess those guys took over the town pretty quickly. It's like a 10 minute assault. It's like a record time right there. Hell yeah. <laughs> you gonna say hi or something? Maybe that's not the attention, homie. Oh man, of course it's raining outside again. It's been raining for like a month straight. Hey, there it is. <laughs> of course, immediately it's like rock music and stuff. Oh, dude, I'm so ready for this. Marines, spotters have a possible fix on all Assad in a building at the west end of this town. Okay. We're gonna secure the perimeter and grab all Assad. Hurrah, lock and load. <laughs> that sounds uh, very easy the way you're putting it, but okay. Shoreline coming into view. Copy, Striker 6 4. Wow. Be dry in 10 seconds. Copy. He's got a lot of ammunition. He's ready to get into some shit. Roger that. We've got RPGs down there. Yep. 
What is this? It's like fish in a barrel. There's so many helos. We didn't need to drive through the town. Just saying. Okay. Alright. Let's get it, Marines. Where's your base plate, homie? What if you have to put on night vision? Alright, let's go. <laughs> They're... That is very quick with the sea wire. What are you wearing, dude? He's got no base plate on his helmet. Alright. Hey, you're talking with some authority now. I like it. Oh, he's got that. Okay, what is that? He's got a shoddy. He's got the, the M4. Oh, he's got that. No. Oh, he's, he's got the old school M16. Dude, I'm nerding out. Alright, I'll get my head in the game. Alright. I'm going to try and pie across this doorway. All right, we got two running to the left. Throwing a flashbang. All right, the left wall is clear. We have a doorway. Okay, I'm going to throw another flashbang. All right, I'm going right. All right, right side's clear. There we go. All right. I know what this calls for. Yep. You always want to make sure you cover where the grenades go in just in case people start running out and stuff. Okay. Got voices on the right. Alright, let me clear out this room real quick, guys. Cool. Ooh. Hey, okay, some intel. Take it. All right, we get doorway front, doorway on the right, two doorways on the right. Oh, throwing a frag, and another frag. All right, pushing through the front doorway. Okay. All right, I'll come with you, dude. Let's get it. Right side clear. Right there, yep. Alright, what have we got on the left side? Is that clear? Okay, we got a conjoined doorway. Alright, pushing up. All call signs, check the bodies. We need a positive ID on all aside. No ID over here, sir. No sign of Al Assad here, sir. HQ, this is Red Dog. Target building is secure, but we don't have Al Assad. Over. That's sketchy. <laughs> Roger that HQ out. Hmm. I just got word that Al Assad is broadcasting half a click east of here at a TV station. That's very convenient. Take down the package there. Move out. All right, we're going street to street. Just like Way City. Let's get it. Okay. I think you guys got that one covered. All right, contacts front. Oh, where's my grenade launcher? I don't have one. That sucks. All right, throwing frag. Oh, grenade. Oh, boy. Ooh, I'm exposed. All right, dude, you should probably find some better cover. This dude just got his pistol out. All right, pushing up. Hey, popping. Right. Damn. Right. Pushing up on the right. Where they at? Where they at? Yep, there we go. Oh, what? What? Oh my gosh. I did not expect that. Dude, this would be crazy. This would be hella stressful. You got people all over the place. Alright. Where did this dude come from? What? 
That's very confusing, but okay. Watch out. Oh, what the heck? It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. What the heck? Ah, okay. These dudes are just jumping over walls, I guess. Good grief. Alright, dude. Pushing up. Cover my left. Yep. Oh, man. What do we got? Courtyard clear? No. Dude, watch out. These guys are gonna freaking flank us. That's a grenade. Okay. More from the front. Watch out. Oh, LT, you're getting it. Alright, watch out. I'm throwing a frag. Pushing up. Oh, oh, oh. Hell yeah, it is. Yep. Oh, the gun sounds sick, though. Alright, one down. Pushing up. Alright, RPG's down. Yep, I see him. I see some flashes. What's going on? I'm gonna do what's called a pro gamer move. Oh, what the heck? Got him. That's what you get, punk. Alright. We got some contacts in the front. Watch out. Where are they out? Point him out. Alright, second floor. He's got him covered. Watch out. Ooh. Okay. We got two guys. RPG on the roof. And take him out. Let's see, throwing a grenade. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Oh, cover me. Alright, throw another frag. What the heck? Yeah, you can have that one right back, homie. Oh, boy. Oh, these frags suck, dude. Alright, I'm pushing up, dude. We need to clear this roof out. All right, he's down. RPG is down. All right. I like the communication though. You guys are spot on. Ooh, that's nice frag placement too. Catch this one, homie. Okay, he's down. All right, pushing up. Okay. Ooh. Them LT, you trying to get the Medal of Honor or something? All right, that dude's down. Watch out for the grenade. All right, push into the roof. Yeah, what's up, dude? Nice transition, though. I'll give it to you. Okay, what do we got? All right, coming down. Hmm, this is getting hectic. And these helos are a big target. I'm surprised they're. They're getting it as much as they are. All right, let's push to the right. All right, oh, we got a, ooh, enemy fire team, huh? Oh, frag, frag out, oh! Oh man, yeah, that was uh, not a good one to throw. These guys are throwing grenades like it's nobody's business. They're giving that shit out like it's Halloween candy. Yep, two down. Let's, yep, watch out. Get away from the car. Watch out, dude. Sir. Watch out, sir. Watch out, grenade. Oh, okay. Dang, he got got. Watch out. On the right, or on the left. Oh! Alright, rooftop. And grenade. That's a, th that's a crappy thing, dude. They freaking frag you and you need to push up. Oh, LT, dude. He's really trying to get that Medal of Honor. All right, watch out. Grenade. Out. Where'd it go? All right, that's good. Pushing up. All right, dude's on the left. Ooh, there we go. We got lit up. Good stuff, Private. Oh, okay, Sergeant. 
Private Sergeant. Okay, yeah. Target building in sight. Phew. All right, good job, Marines. Good use of cover too. This is going to be interesting. What do we got? Inward, inward opening door. Do it. Breaching, breaching. Go, go, go. Right, I'll be a three man. Right, push. Me. All right, we got a doorway front, hallway front. Oh, he's calling for his buddies, I guess. Let's see if he can hang with that. All right, pushing up. Going on the right. All right, we have a doorway on the right. Ooh. Okay, this is extremely sketchy. I got one. <laughs> All right. Oh, dude's in the far room. All right, they're good. Watch out, dude, dang. Oh, dude! Yeah, take that, homie. I see you too. Where you at? And, yeah, what's up, dog? Okay, pushing up through the window. What do we got? We got a dude in the corner. Ooh. Bunch of server racks or something. All right, we got a big room. All right, let's skirt the le let's skirt the uh, right side. Okay. Oh, second floor. Dude, this would be crazy to clear out. Oh. Ooh. Got a tourniquet. Got a pistol. What kind of pistol is that? Looks like a USP. Huh, okay. Interesting. Yeah, what's up, dog? Oh, RPG on the second floor. Alright, he's down. Ooh. Oh, come on now. I'm trying to look at this dude's M16. Oh, man, they're relentless with the flashbangs. Whoa, all right. Yeah, right, these punks trying to be all violent. Okay. All right, punks, you wanna use violence? Oh man, yeah, they, they do, they're not messing about. Okay. Yep, you can have that one back. Dude. Oh my gosh, all right, so this is like a, this is definitely what it's like with the uh, whole fish in a barrel concept. So, all right, let's just clear this out. It's a little bit better this time. Oh, yeah, there you are, freaking homie. Okay, got a foothold in this side if you guys wanna start making your way over here. Yep. Dude, this is crazy. What's up, dog? Yep, have fun with that, dude. Watch out. What the heck? Oh, they're gonna flank us. Watch out. What the f What the heck? Dude, they're flanking us. Hardcore. Oh, RPGs. Alright, pushing up. One dude over here. Uh oh. They're gonna rush me. They're definitely gonna rush me. Okay, we're good. Yep, what's up, dog? Check your corners next time. Okay. And this is. Oh! Okay. What else? What do we got? What do we got? One dude in the back. Alright, Sayonara. You guys, what's up? All 
Alright, he's down. Dude, what the heck? Dude, you better watch out. We're gonna come right behind you. Okay, I think we're doing a lot better this time. Oof. Yeah. Oh, we got an RPG. Oh, boy. Oh. Yep. Oh, my gosh. Reload, reload. Oh! Jeez. Alright, where are they at now? Dude, they have endless grenades. And endless dudes, too. I feel like I'm not making any process here. Progress, I guess. The right word. Ooh, okay. Second floor, yep, I see him. Reload. Oh, okay. What's up, dog? Okay, I think we have only got a few left over. It's a Marine. Oh, dude, are you freaking kidding me? Who did that? You freaking punk. Yeah, eat that. Where else? All right, back corner. Room clear. Move up. Okay. Be on the second floor. Eat that. Sheesh, that was freaking rough, dude. I never understand these massively thick picture frames with these yeah, super small point. pictures. Oorah. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. A little oorah. <laughs> I wouldn't be oorah after that, dude. I don't know about you. Hold your fire. Friendly's coming out. Where? What? No sign of Al-Assad, sir. All right. All That's satisfying. Stay frosty. <laughs> <laughs> and then, what does this say? What to order when you've ordered enough? Is that a real book? <laughs> okay, that's pretty funny though. Okay, I remember this part. Let me get the shotgun off. Yes, sir. Ooh. Glass, go away. Nice. Free haircuts. Oh! Yeah, maybe you shouldn't slide next to a flaming car like that. Oh, okay, that was a headshot. This guy's getting torn. Oh! What's up, dog? Okay, yep, got him. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, now they know where I am now. Okay, sit down, son. What's up, dog? <laughs> Oh, this is fun. Oh, what the heck? Alright, are we done? No? Okay. Hell yeah, dude. These users are just loving this. Look at this. <laughs> yeah, they're loving it. Let's see what we got. Okay. The kit is definitely not accurate, but that's, that's okay. Helmet didn't work too well, dude. Alright. Are we done? Watch yeah. Six, double dog. <laughs> okay. The one dude with, like, no shirt on. What the heck are you doing? Staff sergeant. Come on now. You're supposed to be setting the example, and you're... You shouldn't be carrying the saw, either. But, alright. I mean... Guess if you really need someone competent on that weapon... Well, here's some some voices. All right, Breacher, are you ready for this? Oh, ah! Chat me in the corner, dude. All right, let's 
Get it. That's the way it goes sometimes. Briggs, turn that off. I got something better anyway. Command, this is Red Dog. TV station secure. No sign of Al Assad. The broadcast is a recording. Over. Yeah. Ooh -rah. Roger that, Command. This Al LT is a beast, dude. Marines, rally up. We got a new assignment. Get your gear get ready to move out. Let's go. <laughs> dude, I like that M16. It's such a classic. <laughs> Man, what a crazy mission to start Call of Duty as a Marine. Good grief. <laughs> 